We'll uh, talk to you in a little bit with monkeypox cases on the rise in Georgia and COVID numbers back up. Fulton County is taking a proactive approach to tracking cases by testing wastewater. CBS 46's Madeline Montgomery is live from Fulton County's Camp Creek wastewater facility with how that process works and how it'll inform decisions made by county leaders. Rob, scientists tell us that to know where COVID or the monkeypox are or how many people have it, all they need is to get about a coffee cup full of water from here, from the wastewater plant, and send it off to a lab. When you have COVID or monkeypox, it sheds off of you. Then those viruses will show up in the wastewater that's being processed here. Scientists can then analyze that and come up with an estimate of people infected based off of the number of viruses per liter. With monkeypox up to about 300 cases in Georgia, Fulton County leaders decided it was time to get an idea of where those cases are located and how fast the infection is spreading. Testing from different wastewater plants will give a rough idea of area in the county where there are issues. And these past few weeks, the CDC has seen an increase in COVID cases throughout the country. That's why the water is being tested for that as well. As we all know, people are not being tested uh, like they were in the beginning. So this gives us our public health departments and our leaders and policymakers an idea of what's going on out in the public as far as infection rates. Those test results take about a week to get in, and then those are going to be posted on Fulton County's website. Reporting live in Fulton County, I'm Madeline Montgomery, CBS 46 News.